Some time ago, I made a video about Mount Irving Beach, Tobago, and there's a link in the video description. That video focused on what is called the hotel side of the beach. Today, I'm going to explore what is called the public side of Mount Irving Beach. It's a glorious day in Tobago with blue skies and we are on Chauvin Road going past Grange Bay. Soon we encounter the turn off to the Mount Irving Bay Resort and Golf Club. Now we are at the entrance to what is called the hotel side of Mount Irving Bay Beach. But that is not where we intend to land today. So on we go. Ah, we've reached the entrance of the car park to what is called the public side of Mount Irving Bay Beach. I have said previously that all beaches in Tobago are public access, but habit over the years has led to this side being called the public side. On this beach, there are numerous cabanas that are free for use. This side of Mount Irving Beach is popular with surfers as there's a reef offshore that creates the break for the surfers. With the almond trees and waves gently rolling on the shore, this side of the beach is beautiful, but the only really good bathing area is in front of the beach bar and the area where the fishing boats moor. Without a doubt, this entire bay is scenic, 
But the lifeguards, yes, they are lifeguards on this section of the beach. They tend to stop you bathing in the section in front of the almond trees and send you to the area in front of the bar. On afternoons, this bar is very popular. In paradise. I had said that the section near the fishing boats is the best bathing, and that is where you see all the local boys bathe. So let me give you a little view of what lies below this water surface in this section of Mount Irving Beach. If you liked this video, please hit the like button and share the video. If you want to see other videos of outdoor activities in Trinidad, select one of the videos that is appearing on your screen now.